low end, that bass, that 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 bass. What's going on, YouTube? Twitch Child 420 here. And today we got a little bit of SMD CC1 testing. Now I know you guys know about the DD1. The text the fuck out of some distortion. Now let's calibrate the shit out of some crossovers. Alright folks, let's get started. Alright folks, here we got the Arc Audio XDI 600.1. If you guys remember in the subwoofer giveaway, I dd one did uh, to make sure we were getting a clean signal in the free air video. Eight on the 600.1, I'm gonna throw the old DD1 on it. Don't worry about the CC1, that'll come later. Okay, well here's the problem folks, you see the uh, low pass crossover? That thing goes from 55 to 250. Now that's no good, that's no good. We wanna set a crossovers right, we wanna cut off what frequencies our subs are playing, but that's a pretty broad range. You don't know if you're getting it right or not. Well, that is where the CC1 is gonna come in hand. All right, folks, let's get ready to do this. Uh, the CC1 also allows you to gain match multiple amplifiers uh, with ease. We're gonna get into that in another video. We're also gonna test a four channel amp, get all the frequencies, high passes, and so forth down. All right. We got two discs here. Why two discs, you say? Well, there's a shitload of frequencies out there, people. A shitload. So, what I'm gonna do is find the disc with the frequency that I wanna set this amp to. Also, check it out. Your boy signed the, signed the book, please. Get on my level, son. Anyway, um, I like, I want my bass to cut off at 70 on these JL10s. The amp's been doing good, giving them a pound and letting people see what see what the soundboard's all about but let's go ahead and i want to cut that thing off at 70 hertz so let's see here track list on the cc1 71 hertz that works that works uh it's gonna be track 15. all right so let's go ahead and pop one of these bad boys in right, folks i got it on track 15 which is 71 hertz uh you see i've got a signal here dd uh cc1 is hooked up to uh the ground on the amp and the positive going into the positive speaker. We got the cross, uh, crossover turned all the way up at the moment. All right, let me go ahead and start this over so you guys can see. Hold it off to initialize, turn it on. Bam, we got a signal. Green is good. If I turn the volume up, it goes red. You don't want red. Back the volume down until it's green. There we go. Now we're gonna hit read. All right. We'll grab this little trusty fella here. We're gonna go ahead and head over to the low pass filter. We're gonna start turning it until we get oh, 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 oh. until we get right in the middle. Bam! Calibrated, bitches. All right, so now the sub woofer low pass filter is set to 71 hertz. That's where we want it to cut off. And bam, is that easy, folks? Hmm. Uh, next, uh, next up, we're gonna be doing probably some four channels and vehicles. Uh, probably try to do some game matching with this puppy. Show you guys how that works. But, uh, you know, not too bad for now. You guys see how it works. It's really simple. Hook the thing up, set it to the right track for frequency, turn it up till you get the blue. We're golden. All right, folks. So, uh, this is Twitch Shop 420. Big shout out to the homie SMD. And we will be back for more CC1 testing. I'm out. Stay sexy, YouTube. The way, but it feels like I'm by you. Boom. Hitting hard like an uppercut from Ryu. Trunk set claim, cause it bang like it's Dabu.